To lose your sin Did you know that you are dearly loved? The Lord is my shepherd and I shall not be in want. He makes me lie down by green pastures and he leads me by quiet waters. He restores my soul. And he leads me in the path of righteousness for his name's sake. And even though I may walk through the shadow of the valley of death, I will never fear evil for the Lord is with me. I am resting, resting in the joy of what Thou art. I am finding out the greatness of Thy loving heart. Thou hast been His gaze upon me, and Thy beauty fills my soul. Transforming power, thou hast made me whole. Jesus, I am resting, resting in the joy of what thou art. I am finding out the greatness of. Trusting the Lord Jesus, I behold thee as thou art, and thy love so pure, so changeless, satisfies my heart, satisfies its deepest longing, meets supplies its every need, compasses. Thy 
excuse me if I get a little teary-eyed, this is my reflection. Um, last night was my last night of worship as a youth on a tour. I gave, I've gone to this church for as long as I can remember, so I knew this night would be hard. We started out by going to a hidden chapel within St. Meinrad, and we sang some of our tour songs. I immediately lost it and felt so vulnerable. Then I saw some other senior girls move to the altar in the chapel with the same teary eyes. It felt so good to hold on to the people I have grown up with and who are feeling the same emotions as me. Worship went on with tears coming and going, and then it was just all over. Six years in this youth ministry were almost completed. I was not ready to say the least. As usual, my church family felt the same way. We stayed outside in the heat and humidity in the middle of the night, holding hands while Austin played guitar. We sang songs from our early middle school days all the way to ones we learned just this week. I will always remember this night in this church. Our time as youth may be over, but we will always be repping Bumsy everywhere we go. <laughs> Imagine if the world were like a sunshine tour. We would all be happy wearing the same clothes for a week. <laughs> we would overlook the wrinkles and the fact that our shirts may need an extra shot of Febreze. We would always feel bad when we snapped at someone due to a lack of sleep, and then we'd hug it out and move on. We would carry heavy luggage, unload and reload three charter buses countless times for others we barely know. We wouldn't question why on earth do they need that much stuff for a 10 day trip. We could all survive on only four hours of sleep, and we would forgive those who kept us up even later. We would all give a ring away because an old lady admired it. We would hug on a chaperone who was overwhelmed, letting her know that she was our number one priority at the moment. We would forgo riding the rides at a theme park with our senior child to stay and build a relationship with a teen who wasn't too excited about that particular ride. We would weep because an injured member of the choir was worried that she would miss the opportunity of singing the national anthems at a baseball game with her friends. We would love on kids we just met in the same way we would love on, on the elderly who have been forgotten in a nursing home. That's the Sunshine Choir Tour. The bad news is that we can't stay on tour forever. Maybe by experiencing one through performing, chaperoning, planning, funding, or just passing by, we can all be changed upon return and try a little harder to make the world a sunshine tour, touching hearts and transforming lives.
Class, class, senior class, 2011. We want you to lead us in May the Peace of the Lord. We've taken pictures of many of them from tour. So as you see your picture come up, come on up, seniors. Some classic poses. For time's sake, seniors, come on up. We're going to scroll these pictures and let you see them. Any other seniors that didn't get to go with us on tour, please come up and join us. Come on up right up here, guys, all the way up to the middle. Oh, Tyler, get, you're getting lots of FaceTime. Meanwhile, can we still be connecting our May the Peace circle? You guys stay with us. Come on up, seniors. Big rocks. Get up on the top step. Second, second set. Second set. Take it on up. Take it on up. Girls, girls, girls. Come on up to the steps. Up to the second set. They really love themselves. You can go a little faster.
All right, we got one more. Everybody say. All right, for those of you not in the know, Nathan Renfro is playing football at Maryland and couldn't be here. Now he is by Skype. Let's say hi to Nathan Renfro. All right, so he's going to be singing along with us. Would everybody stand, and we are going to join in prayer together. Tell Nathan we're about to pray and stop talking. <laughs> Let's pray. God, we have so many reasons to give you thanks. We give you thanks for the gift of music that you've given us tonight for the ways this music has touched our hearts and our lives. God, we give you thanks for this group of seniors. We thank you for their heart, for their leadership, for their passion. And we pray your presence with them as they continue on in their faith journey. But God, more than anything else, we give you thanks for your love for us. We give you thanks for the fact that there's nothing we can do to make you love us any less. We thank you for the fact that even though we might try to run hard and fast away from you, we can never, ever get away from your love. And God, help us to respond to your love, to open our hearts and our lives, and to share it with everyone we meet. Give us the courage and the strength to follow your son, Jesus Christ, in all that we say, in all that we do, and in all that we are. It's in his name that we pray. And everybody said, Amen. Amen. Oh, 